Hi, it's Ann again. I am here to show you how to work your Zoom meeting or how to be a good participant in a Zoom meeting. So I'm just gonna kind of show you around the meeting room, basically. So this is our meeting that we scheduled already and I am just gonna go ahead and start the meeting a little bit early. I had it for 1.30, but I'll go ahead and start it now. And I'll be the only one there for demonstration purposes. Okay, so you'll get this little pop-up window. I'm going to open my Zoom meeting. It's launching. I may have to wait for a few seconds and let it launch. And there we go. So that's me. I'm going to join with computer audio. And then it's, let me get the video. This is going to be weird because you'll see two videos of me probably. Oh, it's probably not able to show the video of me because you're seeing it over here, which is okay. So you would see, you would be seeing my face on this instead of over here. But uh, have a look at what it looks like inside. There is, look uh, down here at the bottom. These are all of your tools that you'll use for the meeting. So we can use the mute button if I don't want to talk. I can use the start video or not so that I could be on the screen. And I can invite additional people to the meeting. I can manage my participants. I can share my screen. I want to show you how to do that because like say for example if you were at an IEP meeting and you wanted to show something that was on the IEP then you would be able to log in and just show that and then there's also the chat feature so um, you can click on that and then the chat window comes up over here on the side and you can type a message to everyone so that would be useful if you wanted to give them a link to something or if someone's talking and you want to maybe have um, a chance to share something next then that's a great place to put that um, and then over here is the recording button so you can record the meeting and then when you're ready to end the meeting since you're the one that started it as the host you're the only one that can actually end the meeting. So that's a simple little tutorial kind of going through and then the, as the person who the meeting participants their screens will be very similar and they will have um, the, the same things like they'll be able to chat they won't be able to record but they'll be able to chat and they'll be able to mute themselves if they want to or make it where they're not on video. So that's a real simple look at how to uh, maneuver in Zoom. But let's try the sh screen share. So let's say if I want to share, these are the things that I have open. Um, so let's say I wanted to share my screen with um, this little PowerPoint. Then I click. I clicked on what I wanted. So I had it already. So like, if you know that you're going to share an IEP, go ahead and have a uh, a window a tab open for it that'll just be quicker for you and then I'm gonna I clicked on this and I'm going to share it and then that's what people are going to see on the screen and then you can talk about it and then when you want to stop see down here at the bottom I'm going to click on stop share and then it's kind of going to go back so that is a simple little um, tutorial on zoom don't be afraid of it. It's pretty user friendly and I hope that this helps you in this online world moving forward to um, continue with meetings in a different way and to consider doing therapy in a different way. All right, I will see you in the next video.